Hem here with your daily readings on Wednesday the 9th, not Wednesday, Thursday the 19th of September. I'm doing our daily readings from the original Rider Waite Tarot deck conceived of by A.E. White and designed by Pamela Coleman Smith. So as usual, I'm going to get our energy of the day card, which went crazy town then. I'm going to get our problem if there is one. They're showing me them. Do you know, it's not good when I get to see them. And a solution if we need a solution. Or it's just a bonus card. So let's have a look at our day today. Okay, you ready? So it's Thursday. It's been a really good week, right? I think the messages have been so profound. And you've got to remember, I think a lot of times people watch these readings and they think, oh, that's today's day and this is how things are going to be today. That's not what the angel is giving you. They are giving you a um, like a guiding light to help you on your way, to give you the pointers that you need to make your life work. Now, it's really interesting because I've talked to them about this. And I said, well, how does it work? Because they're global and everyone's different. And they said, well, the weird thing is because we all have our own perception and we come with our own perception, you will perceive it in exactly the right way for you. Isn't that glorious? Isn't it wonderful? Life is wonderful. I have a wonderful life. And so do you, so long as you're willing to check into it. Now, I know some of you are going to say, hey, my life is not wonderful. And maybe sometimes it isn't, because mine isn't sometimes too. But let's look for the wonder in our lives. Like for me, the wonder is a glass that's got little poodles on it. <laughs> just the funny things, you know, find joy in something, even if it's just your cup of water, right? You know, find joy in something, okay. Okay, let's, without further ado, let's have a look at our readings for the day, or today for Thursday. Okay, so for today you've got the Hermit and it's kind of interesting and it makes a lot of sense to me actually. So we've had the Pisces full moon, okay, and we're in the energy of the Pisces full moon still. And the angels are telling me to say to you that you need to go inwards and you need to check into the things that you need to work out and move through. Now, you do need this after every single full moon, they're telling me to tell you. They're saying, tell them, Every full moon is an opportunity to take a couple of days of reflection and space. They're saying, unlike him who doesn't seem to know how to do it. Hey, that is actually what they just said. I've repeated it. <laughs> it is true. I am a bit of a workaholic. I have to learn to get out of that. And they're kind of saying the same thing to you guys as well. They're saying, if you do overwork, find a space. Now, it doesn't have to be a big space. 10 minutes a day, even five minutes a day with a lovely cup of tea or coffee, whatever you love to drink or a nice, you know, cool, refreshing juice or whatever. Stare out the window and really take in the scenery and the feelings and how they show up for you, okay? How they feel for you, right? And so today on this Thursday, this is what they're asking you to do. They're asking you to, if you can take the day off, do it. It would be really good for you, right? If you can't, that's, that doesn't matter. But find a way to give yourself a moment of pleasure, no matter what kind of pleasure it is, find that moment of pleasure. Pleasure is going to work for you today because you need to go inwards and have solace and be in your own space and only your space. You need to be hermit-like until the energy of this full moon in Pisces has dissipated. The other thing the angels are telling me to tell you is that you need to do the right release work and let go of the things that need to go right now because we're in culmination energy because the year is coming to a close and they say they know that this feels early to you for them to say this but they want to tell you this will go quicker than you realize and before you know it will be in 2025 and they want you to take stock now all right my darlings so that's the energy of the day card let's see if there's a problem there is no problem <laughs> sorry <laughs> I'm just so happy. It's nice to see a kind of like the sun. <laughs> maybe, maybe they don't agree. Maybe, maybe the hermit doesn't agree. Oh, I think the hermit's going, come on. No, yeah, it's like bang banging his head going, come on, I have to stay indoors? No, no one's telling you to stay indoors. They're telling you to go out and enjoy the sun. Okay, there is no problem. Do something that brings you enjoyment. Now, anything in this reading that looks dark, which there isn't any anyway, but if there is any darkness, oh, I know what they're telling me to tell you. If there's any darkness in any of this week's reading, it's going to be ameliorated by the sun. So it's going to be brought down in its energy and its vibration. It won't be as strong as it would have been. 
everything is good. They want you to go out and play and enjoy and do something fun for yourself. It doesn't have to be a lot today. It's Thursday, I get it. You're all probably doing something worky related. But if you can get some time off and if you can do something that is going to open the door to fun, today's the day to do it. They want you to laugh, play, enjoy, do something that we're sorry about. That. Do something that really elevates the day for you. And they're showing me laughter. They're showing me people sledding on like a sled in snow. And it's not even the right season for that. Well, it's not the right time here. We've got any snow. But if you've got it, go do it. You know, that's what they're kind of saying. Have fun. Have fun. You know, oh, there's so many people in swimming pool now as well, splashing around and enjoying themselves. <laughs> So it could be either. Um, anything else, angels? Tell them fun, fun, fun in the sun, sun, sun. That's what they just said. So cute. Aww. And like, so there's no solution because we didn't want one. But we've literally got the blah, blah, blah. We've got the four, five, seven of cups. And they're saying they'd like you con to conduct your life in such a way that they're able to bring you all the jewels, the gifts, the happiness, the, the joy the fun, the friends, the capacity to give, to serve, to love, to care. They want to bring you this stuff. So they're asking me to say to you, they're saying, can you tell everyone that's watching this now or in the future or whenever they're watching it, that this is the time to change your vibration by doing the things that change your vibration, okay? So they're talking about funny movies. They're talking about going out with friends that make you laugh. They're talking about enjoying yourself. Now, as part of a caveat to this, and this is where the dark figure comes in, no to people who drain your energy. No to, to news, because news is going to drain your energy. No to the newspaper. No to anything that is going to remove this from your life. Okay? Sunshine. Joy. Peace nature and they said if you're struggling with this a bit and getting in this energy go outdoors and connect with nature no matter what the season you're in nature will immediately uplift your body your structure and your chemistry because it's made that way it's wired that way we are wired to connect into the to gaia to basically we are like the battery with the plug when we put our feet on gaia she is we are plugging ourselves into the energetic vibration of earth source energy and she will give us the light that we need you can touch a tree for this please ask permission though too you can walk in a forest this will do it as well anything else angels you can swim in the sea lakes that kind of thing so let me do it safely of course there you go there's your beautiful day for thursday have a good one do something good hope i do too sending you all so much love do please do please do 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 please give me a thumbs up if you got this far because that could be my little gift for the day right do do feel free to subscribe i'd love to have you on board if you haven't done already and do tell your friends about this channel because i'd love to have more of you watching learning and joining with me in the vibration that i give to you because my reports and my energy is not mine i'm not just doing this the angels are coming in with their vibration we've also got the fairies here this week so we've got high vibration energy which you're tuning into if you watch this in the morning no matter what my words are you'll get the vibration that is of love from the angels and it's a healing code that they want to bring to you do check out the videos if you're interested they may be something you haven't seen if you haven't checked out my videos of the week because it is worth looking back on them even if you haven't seen them already do have a beautiful thursday and i will see you tomorrow with friday's reading namaste everyone take care beautiful day and i'll send you all of the love take care bye bye that's love bye